Hey everyone, my name is Terry G. This is an alcohol free life channel where we learn to live sober one day at a time. If you could take a second, can you please subscribe to my channel and take another second and hit that like button? I'd really appreciate it. Again, thanks a lot for stopping by and let's get to the video. What this video is about, well, let me tell you, I'll back it up a little bit. It's going to be very direct, to the point, and very short, okay? And what I'm going to talk about is emotional health and mental health in sobriety. Okay, that's what I'm going to talk about. And it's very short and sweet. So, a lot of us in early recovery, or maybe even long-term recovery, or even through your journey of recovery for many years or many decades, may experience mental and emotional difficulty. I know in early recovery, I did. I had emotional problems to the max. Life was a roller coaster. I had old traumas, old events, old hurts, old you know resentments I had to look after. All these sort of things were going on inside me that I kept to myself and I wasn't willing to deal with them and it drove me crazy. And if I have, if you have emotional problems, you probably have health issues too. It's like a cancer to our mental well-being, our emotions. It really is. It eats away at us. We think about it in the background all the time while we're leading our lives one day at a time. But I just want to tell you something. And I want you to listen to me and do what I tell you, okay? I don't usually talk like that, but in this video, I think it's, it's, it's appropriate. And what it is, if you're experiencing what I just described in this video, I just want to reassure you that it is totally fixable. What I'm just telling you, it's totally fixable to fix your emotional health and your mental health. It really is. And it's very simple, but a lot of people in recovery do not have the courage to do it because it takes a lot of courage to do it. And what it is, we need to put ourselves out there. And what I mean to put ourselves out there, we need to lay it on the table, talk to our sponsor about it, go to therapy, talk about it in meetings, put some sunshine on those hurting parts of you inside and your life will get better. You do not have to stay like that. You do not have to trudge the road of happy destinies in your sobriety. Sobriety is about freedom, but a lot of us need to back it up, find the courage to talk about what is going on. Because if we help ourselves emotionally and we get some mental well-being going on through therapy or talking about it, your life will explode yeah. in joy and happiness. It really will. Find the courage to put it on the table. Find the courage to, to put some sunshine on those hurt wounds, that trauma, those emotional difficulties that you're experiencing, those resentments, the way you're thinking about things. Lay it out. Tell somebody about it. Go to counseling. Talk to your sponsor. Do a fourth. Do a fifth. Talk about it in meetings. Talk about it to close friends. And you will see your life getting better. You know the way I do it sometimes? I talk about it in these videos. I had a lot of emotional difficulties. I was emotionally handicapped. I couldn't handle life because of my emotions. The way I was thinking was totally out of whack. But as soon as I reached out and started telling people what is going on, it's amazing how my life improved one day at a time. You want to find yourself? Put it on the table. You want to find your true self? Go to counseling, do all that kind of stuff, but get out there, find the courage to find yourself in the journey of recovery. Do that and you'll feel better about yourself one day at a time. Guaranteed it. I guarantee it. Okay? My name is Terry G. This is an alcohol free life channel where we learn to live sober one day at a time. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to hit that like button. But uh, just remember, take it one day at a time. There's no I in team. We need each other. We need a community of support to have a great, great life in sobriety. Okay? So God bless you. Stay sober. Stay safe. And I'll see you next week. Ciao for now.